Dragon Control Warrior. Just curious to try it out. Gerash versus Uther. I will fight with honor. Victory or death. Paladin. Guess I'm keeping these two. Flames up. Well, even if he has muster, he needs owl, and even then, they're pretty efficient traits from my side. Pretty efficient. Oops. I bring the pain. Let the pain speak to me. <clears throat> I guess I just hope that he doesn't have Quartermaster around. It could be a little bit annoying. Do I have a dragon by now? No. Okay. Would be helpful against a bunch of 3-3s, three I guess. Um, looks like an easy death by turn, though. Could hit one of the one ones, but seems a little bit wasteful. If I had a whirlwind, would be good. Two arms, men. <sighs> Pretty good for him. Well, there's a dragon at least. Belcher would have been another good play here. That's seven. I have to crawl back into the game from here. There was a lot of pressure with this Quartermaster. Reporting for duty. Should I execute Sylvan Recruit? I have an answer to Boom at least. Maybe I should have executed instead of using the shield slam because I have the shield maiden still. Uh, might have been better. Second one, that's neat. Um, hit execute, hit corruptor. 
there a better way? This basically heals me for three and this for five. No. a lot better against the second Quartermaster also. Um, True Silver Consecration kills me exactly though. Otherwise I could be able to recover. Use these two. What now? Back to work. I got the beast in my sight. It's me a pretty decent board. It's kind of vulnerable to consecration though. But then he has five mana left. They play shield maiden basically. <laughs> I kind of suspected him to have played Boom already, until turn 9. Might have been a good decision not to, on his side. Huh. Might have to use the Grum to clear. That's, that's annoying. Alright, play 6. What now? These boombots could kill me, actually. But I have to trade these, because they're what going to die. Hmm. Gotcha. Gotcha. No No, I armored up already, so... It's the same amount of health, plus the death rattle, plus I don't need the 5 attack right now. Why not Maiden before the Whirlwind? Because I need something to survive this. Otherwise I have no board at all, and I don't contest anything on the board. Not going to work, I guess. Um. Whew. Alexstrasza would have been a good way to come back here. Uh, maybe Grom, actually. On the other hand, I want to kind of... Uh, taking too much damage. It's kind of out of resources, I just have to continue this way, I guess. Um, Does it make a difference in terms of Quartermaster? A little bit. But if it. He's <laughs> both keep peacekeepers already, so he would need. It's basically a 50 50 if he has a big game hunter or not. 
And even if he has, then he doesn't have it for the boom later. If I if I manage to play it. I would have made the exact same trade with the guy, but if he had quartermaster, the guy would have wouldn't have died. So let's have this going through me. Finally an Alex Trazer. Just need a way to play it. At seven. Go up to seventeen. Taste my blade. Didn't seem to have a big game hunter. Played both key peacekeepers. This should work, right? Or I can play a shield maiden. Death spide, hit this. This doesn't seem too bad actually. I'm at eight. This is seven. One, six. Hmm. I bring life. Could also execute this. Do I have to though? I cannot really deal with Arturian anyways. Like not really. I mean I have to hit and hit it, so Put this apple on your head. Second muster? Put this apple on your head. Uh oh. Reporting for duty. It's a lot of knives. Brawl would be good. A lot of shield maidens. This should finally do something for me. Low cards. Maybe boom and then the whirlwind kills my own boom bots. This might help. Reporting for duty. Didn't play a consecration so far, arms, so. Nah. This helps, of course. looks better now truth is my shield. oh sunwalker reporting for duty I think I don't need a brawl anymore Next time I can probably finally develop my Alexstrasza, uh, Ysera. Finally at 17 life again. This was a fight. <laughs> yeah, nice boom boats, of course. I hope this would end up this way. No more quarter masters. Um, 12, 15... I do Sarah time. Does he even run consecration? <laughs> I've got the beast in my sight. It's all for for twelfth body. Oh, 
This is in consecration range nonetheless. So I traded this into the 3-3. Three, three. Rest would survive a consecration top deck. Yep. Reporting for duty. Does he run mind control tech? Play Sylvanas. Top deck mind control tech. Uh, should be alright. I have no time for games. <laughs> still Sylvanas, then I still have ten damage. Blood Belcher, another ten. Put your faith in the light. <laughs> Reporting for duty. Well, that's good. Back to work. Let none survive. I shall bring you. <laughs> On. Well played. Well played. <laughs> These mini fire elementals are really helpful. I think I keep the shield block. Just because I don't want to run out of health in the end. Maybe keeping death spite isn't even a good idea. Oh, that's a good idea. Probably coin out one of these. This one seems alright. Okay, now I have a lot of health. <coughs> health gain in my hand. Doesn't have an obvious way to kill this right now. Other than abusive, maybe. And if it's mid range, Houndmaster is one turn away. So chances are that I can draw twice. Okay, it's not mid-range. However, I can draw at least twice, so that's helpful. Dragon in two turns would be helpful. It doesn't even trade. Um, of course, it's a face hunter. Might be worth doing it this way. On the other hand, I kind of have enough cards. Could think about executing it, actually. <clears throat> Armor Smith would be nice. No problem. Could hit it with Death Spite. It's probably the best choice. You know, <clears throat> let's see if the two health that I lost will matter. I mean, I'm at 27 if I play these two cards. That's not too scary at the moment. Good thing is he doesn't have an, a bow, so I kind of want to trigger the trap right now. <laughs> so there's my dragon. I can deal like four damage from 
my hand. This. Uh, it should be able to kill everything that you could play. Okay. But it's a face hunter, he doesn't he just doesn't play anything. <laughs> Fine then. I need to play something. I don't want to overdraw. Um Uh, kind of want to cycle first, though. Uh, I would really like to armor up. Hmm. Back to work. As long as he has the bow, attacking will be difficult. Alex Straza will heal me for four. Maybe I set up a board to kill him. Like with Sylvanas and then Alex Straza and hit his face. Oh. Depends on what he does now. Probably won't happen. Oh. That's a little bit scary. Does he have 12 damage? It shows 5. Needs 7 more. 7 isn't even hard, it's like a King Golem Wolf Rider. Whoops. I'm in a pretty tough spot actually. I have no time for games. Just need to hope that I survive this turn and then I can Alex Traza. Uh, given the fact how he played this quick shot last turn, I think I'm dead. Double kill command? Seems like I'm good. <laughs> At the moment. Death to the pretenders. I guess I'll trigger the trap. He still needs just 10 damage. Um, two shield maidens left. I smell blood. To my side. That's good. This helps too, of course. Twelve, no, thirteen, seventeen. 
could set up lethal, but unleash with this on the board. It's a little bit risky. I'll just play it really safe. It's still lethal the next turn. I'm not convinced about Ysera in this deck. Yeah, me neither. It's so hard to play her. Same with Neparian. Maybe one of the 8 mana dragons would be better. One of. I think there's only Chromagus. Chromagus might be the better choice. Still testing it. <laughs> 